out. It is a little bit chilly. We have temperatures in the 40s, so definitely need a jacket. Yesterday morning it was 66, <laughs> yeah. so you were probably like, whoa, this is great. Not today. And it's going to get even colder as we head towards the end of the week. So we've got another system that will come through Wednesday night and kind of bring in another push of cool weather. Even though we're chilly, we're still above normal. We're sitting in the 40s, and at 8 o'clock, we'll still be near 43. By noon, 46, and then 5 o'clock, 48. A little bit breezy, at least initially. The west wind between 10 and 15 miles per hour. That will die down a little bit this afternoon, so not quite as windy and definitely not as gusty as yesterday. In the evening, mostly cloudy and 46 at 7 o'clock. Here is Live Doppler 2 HD. You can see those light sprinkles as they're coming through the Miami Valley. Maybe a light shower in spots. Uh, but really, it's not too much activity out there, just more of a nuisance than anything else. And some of that light rain does extend back to the west. So probably through about mid-morning, we'll be dealing with the potential for a light shower. And then we'll get back to drier conditions as we head into late morning and into the afternoon. It's 41, but it feels like 33. That's our wind chill. We do have that decent breeze coming in from the west at 14 miles per hour. So that's going to keep things feeling chilly this morning for sure. We have 41 here. It's 40 up towards Lima. 43 back in Muncie and Lafayette's 40. So everybody's kind of gotten into this chilly air mass after spending a weekend in the 60s. And it's going to get even colder as we head through the rest of the week. Tomorrow, actually not bad with a high of 56 ahead of the system. But as the system comes through tomorrow night, Thursday's high temperature is 43. Friday's high temperature is only 36. Now remember, the normal high this time of year is 38 degrees, so we're actually just getting closer to normal. We've been well above those normal values. Here's future tracks starting us off with lots of clouds this morning, maybe a spit or a sprinkle out there going into the afternoon, still mostly cloudy at 5. Could be some breaks here and there, and that'll be the case through the overnight hours as well. But we head into tomorrow morning. We'll start off with mostly cloudy skies at 7 o'clock. Going into the afternoon, again, a few breaks here and there, but then clouds will be increasing again late in the day as that next system moves in, bringing in the potential for some showers by evening. Today we'll be up near 50, lots of clouds. It's going to be breezy at least initially and cool. And then overnight, we're going to drop down to a chilly 39 degrees. It'll be mostly cloudy overnight, still dry tonight, and through much of tomorrow, dry weather is expected. We'll see mostly cloudy skies, some breaks of sun at least early on with a high near 56. And then we get into tomorrow evening and that slight chance of a shower. It'll actually increase Wednesday night, and we may even see a lingering shower early Thursday morning. Otherwise, there's the colder air moving in, 43 for a high Thursday. Friday morning, we're down into the 20s and a high of only 36. And we could see a few light snow showers as some of that cold air moves in. Saturday, still looking at mid-30s for highs and overnight lows over the weekend get down into the lower 20s.